here i got this kinder rub for the first time pretty amazing but you know what use whatever you like i've already washed and dried off my pork i'm gonna score it on both sides just like this i also poke some holes in the side i'm gonna rub that dry rub all over this making sure to get in the crevices and i'm gonna wrap it up and keep it in the fridge for at least eight hours i woke up hella early to get this going because it needs some time the first run i'm gonna elevate it and i'm gonna bake it 250 fahrenheit for four hours then i'm gonna transfer it to my braising pan make sure you give it those juices back and then add whatever liquid you like i'm using beer you can use apple juice totally up to you cover this up and I'm gonna put it back in at 220 Fahrenheit for about eight hours. Every few hours I take it out and baste it. We want this to have really good flavor, baby. And when the time had finally come, look at that smooth bone removal. I wanted to be like one of the cool kids that smushes it with their hands, but it was too freaking hot, so I used my tongs. I returned all the juice and let it absorb some of that liquid for flavor. I use this to make pulled pork sandwiches and I can't even begin to tell you how good they are. 